we got an iPhone. Let's flash with recovery mode. The customer tell us that previous the application failed to open. Then while trying to restore, then such error appears. The update process is started to middle and stops. These are the main calls on that iPhone. Let's go to fix it. We also try with restore first. Let's see what happened. The software was extracting. Now the restore process is started with progress bar. While 30% above to restore then message pop up on the screen that the iPhone could not be restored and unknown error occurs. 1100. Such problem shows on lower storage iPhone like 64 GB and the NAND partition was damaged. Remove all app PC carefully. Let's remove PCB. Let's observe the PCB status. Looks fine and no any prior repair sign. First, you have to remove NAND. That fault is related to NAND. So, you have to remove it from PCB. Clean epoxy rosin carefully. Don't use force. May broke small parts near NAND. Put some plugs. Remove NAND. Temperature must be 300 and airflow 60. Don't use force while removing NAND from PCB. This may broke the pads. Clean all pad carefully. Must be flat and sign. Clean all pad carefully. Must be flat and sign. Put some plugs. I am here using the new NAND of 256GB. After changing the new NAND, 
you have to program the NAND data like serial, Wi-Fi address and Bluetooth address too. Also have to unbind Wi-Fi. Put the NAND in correct position. Heat must be 290 and airflow 60 according to your environment. Wait for PCB to cool down for 5 minutes. After inserting the new NAND, the iTunes or software detect iPhone SDFU mode that you have to restore it once. Restore process was going without any error means problem was fixed. Hope this will help you to fix your staff, share your experience and how you solve your issues. If you get a little bit of value from this then subscribe to our channel DGSM Solution and see you in the next video, stay connected.